Eyesore, 5-2 with Jack Moiseev. Pepe Easter at 8-5 with Rod Allen. Taffy B at 30. Rosanna Jane at 30-1. Southgate's Rainbow, 6-1 with Gagliardi. Charlie's Zinger at 12. Teufel is at 25. Ruby D. Hanover, 9-2 with Ray Remen. And Ocala Genie at 99-1. Three-year-old pacing fillies in tonight's opener, track labeled fast. Here's Tom Durkin with the call. And uh, they're off. Peppy Easter is away quickly. On the outside, Charlie Zinger sprinting for the lead as they race for the first turn. And Rosanna Jane is hustled out. And down on the inside, it's Honest Trixie as they race for the first turn. Ruby D. Hanover has come away on the outside, racing fifth, three wide early. And then in between horses, it's O'Cala Jane. And on the inside, Eyesore, who is out seventh. Taffy B is now eighth, followed by Southgate's Rainbow and Teufel as they move over to the quarter in 28 and 4 and they're up the back stretch now and it's Charlie Zinger who takes the field up the back stretch with Ruby D. Hanover now coming up after the lead. Rosanna Jane just in behind the leaders now third and off the rail comes Peppy Easter now and she's on the move. Two and a half lengths back to Honest Trixie who's fifth on the inside with Eyesore now who's off the rail and racing uncovered. Eyesore is followed by Ocala Jean on the rail and Taffy B on the outside. Southgate's Rainbow and farther back Teufel as they move to the half and they're there in 57 and 1. Moving into the far turn, it's Ruby D. Hanover down on the rail on the outside, Peppy Easter. Peppy Easter still parked out and Ruby D. Hanover now will not give up the lead. Charlie Zinger just in behind the dueling leaders and they're followed by Rosanna Jane who's racing fourth. Eyesore poised for the final stages on the outside fifth. Taffy B is moved within five lengths of the lead as they come to the top of the lane and Southgate's Rainbow has found her best stride. Now as the field passes three quarters in 127 flat at the top of the stretch. Ruby D. Hanover cuts the corner and holds on to the lead. Peppy Easter trying to stay with her and Charlie Zinger now waiting for racing room. Inside the final eighth, Ruby D. Hanover in front. Charlie Zinger with room now and coming after Ruby D. Hanover on the inside. Rosanna Jane on the far outside. It's eyesore and farthest out. Taffy B. They're coming to the finish and off stride there goes Charlie Zinger and that leaves Ruby D. Hanover with the victory. That break by Charlie Zinger in the deep stretch may have cost her the victory, but after Ruby D. Hanover parked Peppy Easter, I thought she might run out of gas, but she did hold on. Got a little tired, but she didn't run out of gas. She's an extremely well-bred filly. She's an albatross filly out of a best-of-all mare. That represents the best breeding of Hanover Shoe Farm line. And although she only won one out of nine races last year, I think this, she will do better this year. This is her first start of 1987, and it's a handy victory under Ray Raymond's guidance for John Shigarian and the White Birch Farm in New Jersey, owners of this albatross filly. A lifetime mark, 157, number 9, Ruby D. Hanover wins the first, 1180, 740, 580. Taffy B. was second, 3120 and 1440, and Rosanna Jane finished third, 1820. The 9-4 exacta, $308 even.